Hello friends and welcome back to a brand new vlog. It is Thursday today and I literally have not picked up the camera all week. No idea, I just haven't had any intentions or motivation to pick up the camera. Don't know what's going on with my hair right here. Whatever, we're going to deal with it. But it is Thursday today and I'm actually picking up the camera quite late to start a vlog. It's 11 o'clock already. And I've just been running around cleaning up the house and whatnot. Dropped Nevaeh off to school. Jackson has just gone to the toilet. He was playing in the playroom. Um, but I thought I would pick up the camera today because my sister is coming over today. Well, I'm pretty sure she is after school and she's going to surprise Nevaeh and Jackson. And yeah, we haven't seen her in quite a while I think the last time we've seen her is when we went to the beach so quite a few weeks ago so it'll be good to catch up with her and I thought I would pick up the camera and just like update you guys and whatnot because I feel like I haven't really spoken to the camera much in a while um, not much has changed, not, not a lot has changed, um, but yeah, thought I would pick up the camera and say good morning, I need to do my shopping list today, my budget list and um, my meal planning list today, so I'm probably going to do that now. So I get it out of the way and then I can just chill out for a little bit longer. But yeah, that needs to be done. It is only Thursday, but I like to get my shopping list started on a Thursday. That way, any extras I can add on to the end of the list. And if we go shopping on a Friday, I can just grab my list and you know that's that's a long explanation for why I like to do my shopping list in advance but yeah Jackson do you want to come say good morning say morning come here okay Sissy's gone? Yeah. Where's Sissy? Down there. Is she at school? Yeah. Yeah? It's a school day today for her, isn't it? Yeah. Anywho, I'm going to drop the camera down now. I'm probably going to get those little things done. And I'll speak to you guys in a little bit. Can I please finish what I was doing? 
and pen. Oh, pen. And pen. And shot. And pen. No, because I need it, baby. I need it. I need it, though. I need it. Okay. Can I please think of that? And kids trying to work here. Not happening. For the week, I'm going to stick this on the fridge before I forget and just gets mixed with all the rest of my crap. But I'm actually quite worried that a lot of the things on my shopping list won't be in stock because of this whole coronavirus um, situation and everyone stocking up on food and toilet paper and whatnot. We actually do need toilet paper this week, so fingers crossed we can get it. Don't like our chances, but we're just going to go for it and see if we can get it. Not much we can really do about it. Um, this whole coronavirus thing has been taken and blown way out of precaution. Um, I, I'm not so much concerned. It doesn't really worry me. Yes. There is some worries here and there, like obviously I don't want to get it. Being pregnant, that is a risk and also the kids and whatnot. But at the same sense, we get common colds every single year and so many more people die from the common cold. So I just, it, it, it's frustrating me that everyone is going and stocking up on all these resources and whatnot and leaving nothing on the shelves to the point where other people can't get anything and is being left with nothing so that is quite frustrating like I do understand that some of these people are just trying to I don't know be prepared and what not because there obviously is a certain amount of days of quarantine if you catch it and whatnot but i just think it's been taken and blown way out of precaution um it's not to say i'm not worried because obviously i worry about everything and i don't want to catch it so obviously that is a factor but i just think it's very what is going on in Australia right now is, it's been, I don't know, it's something else. I just, I just don't get it. I'm going to stop rambling on that subject. And Jackson is wanting me to go and play with him. So I'm going to go play with Play-Doh with him for a little bit. And then I'm going to chill out and probably watch some maths and just hang with Jax. To fly. Um, what have you done? Don't get all stuck in there. Yeah. Um, no. Oh, you want it in there? What? Um, no. Can I have some play doh? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, I'm happy. Is this all I get? Help me. Help you? Yeah. What? My is broken. It's broken? Yeah. What's broken? I have this. 
Who should we make? Six. You want me to roll it? Yeah. What do you want me to make? A snake? Yes. Yeah. you guys I ended up chilling out with Jackson playing some play-doh and blocks and then watching some maths and then obviously going and picking up Navea and we've just gotten home and we also have a little guest well not little but we have a guest as I said before my sister was coming over and she ended up coming over <laughs> So, Nevaeh got a nice surprise when she finished school. Um, but there was an incident at school today where Nevaeh's money, where Nevaeh's money had been stolen. This isn't the first time it's happened either. This is the third time that it's happened in the past three weeks, which is so defeating because She's literally been there for like five weeks or five and a half weeks or something along those lines and this just this just keeps happening and I feel so defeated. I have no idea what to do because I want to be able to still give my daughter money to have that independence to go to the canteen but her money keeps getting stolen so I'm in a world of all minds right now I don't know what to do <sighs> I'm just feeling very flat and defeated but hopefully her teacher can get onto it and stop this from happening I did not expect this to be happening in kindergarten especially so early on but looks like that's what I'm dealing with now so yeah <laughs> but all the dinosaurs are not yeah. here in the world anymore. Yeah, they're yeah. extinct. Yeah, they are born. <laughs> you missed the dinosaurs? Yeah, you, you never met them. But I wish, I wish they could eat us. <laughs> what? <laughs> What's up, Jax? Yeah, so we can see the inside of its mouth. <laughs> Do you watch the magic or something? Uh, no, I just want to see the inside of its <laughs> tomorrow Nevaeh actually has a lunch order so she doesn't need to take a sandwich because she'll be ordering her big lunch but in this container she just has some cherry tomatoes some cut up cucumber and some red capsicum this is more so her snack container so she's got a cinnamon roll and two Oreos a pack of shapes her favorite cheese snack 
and then in this container is her sip and crunch which has cut up oranges You're right. B. Oh, I think I know. And then. That's me. But good job. You wrote me. Me. Can you write B? B, okay. But now. I'll make that happen, sorry. Can't write backwards, baby. And then... Oh, yeah, I forgot. Close enough. And now, at. 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 Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> Come on. Oh, funny. At. Good job. I finally got it. High five, Lil. <laughs> I'm going to put your hand up after it. Wait, more harder. <laughs> oh, wow. This lighting is horrible. And I have just taken my makeup off. Hence why my skin's a little bit glowing red at the moment. It tends to happen after I take my makeup off and wash my face. But anywho, I'm going to wrap this vlog up here because it is going on 7.30 and I need to wind these kids down. Lisa's going home very shortly and then before I know it, it will be bedtime and Robert will be home. So I hope you guys enjoyed today's vlog. If you did, don't forget to hit that thumbs up and subscribe if you are new. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye for now.